so hi friends this is amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video so in this video i will talk about the expected date for the april attempt what and the, what will be the effect of postponement on the marks versus percentile and what will be its effect on percentile versus rank if less or more number of student appear in the next attempt and i will also talk about the refund or transfer dates and will there be a correction window for the next attempt or not if the if the both attempt be combined then you will get correction window or not so, so i will discuss all those questions in this video so uh, you have asked these questions through the comment section instagram and whatsapp so i'm considering this this question and after watching this video if you have any type of doubt or any type of question you can ask in the comment section or instagram or whatsapp so that i can take those questions in my next video so if you're first to my channel please try to subscribe the channel so that you will get the next video also and i will upload many video related to j mains and also about other entrance exam in the future days so don't worry i will guide you throughout the counseling so if you have any doubt uh, about the preparation or anything about the jmains or other entrance exam you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp you will get both the link in the description box so let's start the video to improve your result by next attempt that is april or may attempt so there is a test series that is h ranker test series so the feature of this test series is very important that is 102 test you will get first of all you will get a free mock test so you can analyze the test if you feel good you can use this test so i uh, really uh, advise you please join this test series that is created by iit madras and iit mumbai uh, professors so you just need to enroll in this test series and you can get the discount at this time also and after uh, giving each test in this test series you will get all india ranking and all type of analysis which type, this type of, of topic is uh, a strong uh, for you and which type of topic is weak for you after go after doing each and every test so there is topic wide test and whole syllabus test also so try to join this test and you can attempt it on a uh, wave that is in your uh, mobile laptop or uh, computer use also. the coupon that is information and get the discount of 1400 so you can uh, just enroll in this uh, test series by paying 2100 only uh, you just need to uh, use the code that is information and you will get the link for app and website in the description also. targeting uh, next year je that is uh, you are in class 11 right now so that uh, then also this series is very useful because the validity of this test series is lifetime you can use it any so here is the post point effect uh, what are the question and their answer I will try to discuss in this yes. video so, so here is the first one that is will there be any effect on marks versus percentile yes there will be surely an effect on marks versus percentile because the student are getting more uh, time to prepare so that their preparation will be uh, will be increased and their preparation will goes to the next level so they can uh, score more marks so that you can you can think about the, you will get less percentile in higher marks if the paper difficulty is not so hi so there will be effect in marks versus percentile as all the students are preparing well for the exam so the next question is effect on percentile versus rank yes there will be effect on percentile versus rank if the number of a student will decrease in the next attempt then you can get good rank in uh, in the less percentile also suppose if you are getting 95 percent uh, if there is to, uh, even like unique student uh, appear in the all four attempt of the je then your rank will be around 55 or 56 thousand but if it is only 10 uh, 10 lakh then you can expect it to be around 50000 rank so the effect on percentile versus rank will, uh, will be there if the number of a student change in the next attempt due to the com uh, combined exam or different exam or due to the co covid cases also so the next one is can both the attempt be combined yes if the covid cases will uh, continue uh, to rise in this manner as it is now so there will be a combined exam if there is no uh, space for the both the exam uh, april and uh, may attempt both to be conducted separately then there should be at least 15 days gap between the both the exam so now i will talk about the when april attempt will take place you can, you can expect it to be uh, to be held after the uh, first half of the june that is in the second half of june you can expect it to be happen so you have around 40 to 50 days to prepare so i hope you are preparing well for the exam and be ready for the scenario that is if both the exam can be combined then competition level will be increased so be prepared for that also and don't be relaxed that you have so much time because every student are preparing so the next one is what about the refund or transfer so for the refund and transfer i have made many video previously so try to watch my previous video that i have shown live how to apply for the refund or you have applied then when you will get the refund and where you will get the refund or you have applied for the transfer so it will be 
uh, effective or not so all those things have been discussed in my previous video so please try to watch that video you will get the link in the description box or i button also so the next one is will there be correction window if combined yes there will be correction window for sure if combined or not no matter because many a student haven't applied for the may attempt now so they they will get the opportunity to apply only if the correction window or registration window will open if the registration window will open then correction window will surely open and you can do all the things what you are able to do in previous correction window that is category correction or uh, exam center correction or anything that you want so this is all about the correction window so the next one is percentile versus college which college you can oh, get in a particular percentile so for this i have made many videos try to go into the playlist section of my uh, of my channel there you will find different type of playlist that is an it cutoff video triple it cutoff gfti cutoff so all those videos are available and that is uh, there i have discussed the percentile that you require to get the a different type of branch in a particular NIT or different NIT. So try to watch that video so that you will get the idea of percentile versus college. So the next one is category wise cutoff. Will there be category wise cutoff in the percentile versus college uh, video? Yes, there is category wise cutoff when I have made video for PWD candidate also. So if you are from any category general, EWS, OBC, SC, ST or PWD, male, female, home state, other state, all type of video you will get there. So please try to watch those videos. It takes so much effort to make those videos. So try to watch that video so that it will be helpful for you and you can do your counseling in a better way. So this is all about the postponement effect question and answer. So hope you find this video very useful and try to subscribe the channel if you haven't done it yet and try to ask the question if you have any doubt so that I can take those questions in my next video. So thanks for watching this video.